Hello, it's Darren at Moonhair Studio with another Moonhair Quick Tip. You know the feeling when you've been noodling around and you suddenly come up with the perfect cue? And then you realise you weren't recording it and you can't even remember what it was that you did. Well, Cubase can. Press Shift and the star or multiply key and there's your last recording in all its glory. And how does this work? Well you do need it set up. Um, if you're in Cubase 9.5 or before you'll go into your file menu but in Cubase 10 we're going to edit and you're looking for your preferences. And under MIDI here you will notice that you've got this retrospective record. So as long as that is clicked on and you've got a big enough buffer here set, anything that you're doing MIDI that's going into Cubase is constantly being recorded and you'll be able to recall it with that shift and star key again. So I hope that's been a useful tip for you and uh, please do pop in again. There's plenty more where that came from and if you want to like and subscribe that's totally up to you. Um, I don't need the subscriptions for any particular reason, but it might be handy for you to keep track of what's going on. Okay then, thanks a lot. Bye.